I'm Kate Rooney on Howard Jones Field for USCFootball.com with defensive coordinator Ed Orgeron. Coach, how do you feel spring ball is going so far? Excellent. I think our defenses have improved in every area. Every area. We love our new coaches, and uh, the guys are getting better. Offense got after us a little bit today, but overall we've had an excellent spring. You mentioned the new coaches. What do you think uh, Scotty Hazelton and Marvin Sanders are bringing to the team that you, you might have been missing last season? Well, I don't know if we were missing, but they're college coaches. They've defended the college game for a long time, especially the spread offenses, the option stuff that we're seeing. So they brought some new ideas that I think are really going to help us against some of the spread teams. We're going to be seeing s some things out of new guys this year. There are three guys who redshirted last year. Let's let's just go through them. Uh, what are you looking for from Anton Woods this season? Yeah, well, you know, Antoine lost a lot of weight. He's really coming along, showing some quickness. Has, still has a way to go, but we're looking for that big nose tackle that's really quick inside. You know, against teams that run the football, he should really help us. Uh, how about Greg Townsend Jr.? He's he's somebody else people are looking at. Well, you know, he, there's a, there's a spot open for the third end in the rotation, and he's up for it. But there's some other guys, Kevin Green, uh, Morgan Brunson, some new guys you may mention. They're all fighting for that spot. Also, Leonard Williams is a freshman coming in is going to be fighting for that spot. Let's go back to Kevin Green for a little bit. He's really good athlete, big, fast. We're wondering what we're going to see from him on the field. Can you give us a little bit of a preview? Well, you know what? I think that he's going to really help us on third down. He's a good rusher. He's got good speed. He's a great young man. Hopefully this year he can produce for us on third down. Circling back to another guy who redshirted last year, uh, what what do you think that we're going to be seeing out of Christian Hayward? You know, Christian's been hurt, and uh, unfortunately, the most of the time that he's been here, he hasn't been in practice. We like Christian; he's a good athlete, some good quickness. Hopefully, he can have a fall camp and, and you know perform in a backup role. How about Morgan Breslin? You mentioned yeah. him, and what do you think he's going to be bringing to us? You know, Morgan led the J.C. Uh, ranks in sacks the last two years. He's really a good rusher, a straight-ahead guy. He has a little learning curve because he just got in learning his own pressure and stuff. But I really think that he's going to be a guy that we can put in and can get after the quarterback. How do you replace Nick Perry, who left for the draft this year? Well, you know, Wes Horton has done a good job. Wes is a different player. Wes has savvy. Wes has a, has a way of about the game to understand how to beat the offensive linemen. Two years ago, he had nine and a half sacks, who led the team in sacks. So I think that we're going to be pretty good there. What specific areas are you looking to improve uh, coming out of spring practice? Pass defense. You know, our pass defense, we have to get tighter. We have to make plays, yards after the catch, eliminate the big run, and really be a better tackling team, cause more turnovers. I think the, the best thing that we've done here, we've been great, is rush the passer. Uh, our pass rush has not been what it's supposed to be. Hopefully this year we can get up to par. One last question. What's your prediction for who's going to win this year's spring game? Well, it's going to be defense, obviously. I'm Kate Rooney, signing off from Howard Jones Field. You can log on to uscfootball.com for more.